friends, this is Hi-Fi Trainer. In this video, we're going to see how to make tasty chicken lollipops. But before we go into the video, if you haven't already, please subscribe as I've already made many cooking related videos in our channel and I'll continue making more. Now let's go into the video. So I've taken 500 grams of chicken wings. So I got 6 chicken wings in total, which means that I'll get 12 chicken lollipops. So this is how a chicken wing looks like. There's two lollipops per wing. This is the big one and this is a small one. Now this is the joint. You have to pop it and cut between the bones. So let's start with the big one. Now using a knife, scrape one side of the chicken off, like this. So you need to push everything to the bottom, or the chicken and the skin. Now you need to turn all, the, all of it upside down to create the lollipop shape. And that's the big one ready. Now in the small one, there's two bones. We need to remove the smaller bone out. And keep it aside. Now you need to remove one side of the chicken for the big bone, like this. And turn it upside down to create the lollipop shape. So for this one you can put any stuffing of your choice in like paneer or chicken. Now I have my 12 lollipops here. Now let's see how to marinate them. So firstly add 1 4th teaspoon of black pepper powder, half teaspoon of red chilli powder, half teaspoon of salt, 2 tablespoons of ginger garlic paste, 1 teaspoon of soy sauce, 1.5 teaspoons of vinegar and one egg. Now mix it thoroughly. Now let this sit in the fridge for 30 minutes. So after 30 minutes, add 1 fourth cup of rice flour or you can use corn flour as well and 3 tablespoons of all-purpose flour, half teaspoon of salt, and 1 teaspoon of red chili powder. Now mix it. Make sure everything is covered. If you think it's too thick, you can add one egg and mix it. Now put the bones up so it's much easier for frying them. And into a vessel. Add enough oil for deep frying. After the oil is hot, add the chicken pieces slowly. You have to do this on a medium flame so that the chicken aren't burnt. After the first side is cooked, turn them. You only need to fry them until they turn into a nice golden brown colour and then take them out. Now add the second batch. So add the chicken slowly. After they're fried, take them out. You can eat them like this or you can make the sauce. Now let's see how to make the sauce. So into a pan, add one and a half tablespoons of oil, 
one tablespoon of finely chopped ginger and one tablespoon of finely chopped garlic pieces now fry them until the raw smell fades now add one medium sized onion that's finely chopped after it changes color lightly add three tablespoons of chili garlic sauce you have to sort this on high flame for 30 seconds now add one teaspoon of soy sauce two tablespoons of tomato ketchup one teaspoon of sugar and one teaspoon of vinegar now add all-purpose flour slurry which means three-fourths teaspoon of all-purpose flour mixed with some water and then add two tablespoons of water and let the consistency get a bit thick and add the chicken and mix it so that the sauce is coating all the chicken pieces make sure you turn off the flame now you can garnish this with some spring onion greens and then using a piece of aluminium foil wrap it around the bone and delicious chicken lollipops are ready thank you for watching if you like this video please subscribe and turn on the notifications bell to get notified whenever i upload another video